back. Virginia Governor Glenn Youngkin is now about six weeks into his administration. And he's promised to help businesses create 400,000 jobs over the next four years. And to that end, News 3 reporter Brennan Ponton spoke to the governor today. What's he saying about all that? Well, certainly making some big promises on that front. And just this week, his administration announced a rocket company is expanding to Wallops Island, which will create 250 jobs on the eastern shore. Now, there have been other job announcements as well, including another company expanding to northern Virginia to create nearly 200 jobs. During another recent announcement about Amazon building another center in the Shenandoah Valley, he acknowledged Amazon chose Arlington as a second corporate headquarters in 2018, which will create 25,000 jobs. That announcement was made when Governor Northam was in office. Now, Youngkin says governors themselves don't create jobs, but they have to, to create business friendly environments to make it happen. And we asked for specifics on how he plans to help in those efforts. Virginia is open for business and we're clearly communicating that. And in fact, reducing taxes and improving schools and cutting regulations and investing to make our communities safer, safer are critical components of making Virginia the best place for employers to grow their companies. And Youngkin says more job announcements are coming. And coming up on News 3 at 6, a key part of the governor's agenda has been to eliminate the state's grocery tax. With under two weeks to go until the General Assembly session ends, we ask whether he's confident if that will happen. I'm Brendan Ponton, News 3. Brendan, thank you.